the disease so rare it has fewer than 200 diagnosed cases. SNN's Crystal Knowles explains how Sunco's grandmother is raising awareness for the deadly disease affecting her grandson. He's a ticking time bomb. It's heartbreaking. He won't survive without a bone marrow transplant. Sherry Sims is talking about her grandson, nine-year-old Alex Sims. On the outside, he's a regular boy, but on the inside, IPEX syndrome, which is an immune dysregulation, poly and endocrinopathy, enteropathy X-linked, is attacking his organs. His autoimmune system is his worst enemy. The um, immune system destroyed his pancreas, and therefore he now has to take insulin, and, and he's a full-blown type 1 diabetic. She hopes more people sign up for Be The Match, a registry, because Alex needs a bone marrow transplant. So far, they haven't found a match since his diagnosis. Time is running out. Once you order your kit, you'll get it in the mail in an envelope like this. Then what you need to do next is just take one of these cotton swabs and swipe the inside of your mouth and then put it back in the mail. It's just that simple. Sims organizes swab parties, so far testing 425 people with no match. December 26th is his birthday. We may not get many with him. We have our times when we go away and cry. But we don't do it in front of him. She explains most IPEX kids die within the first or second year of life. But Alex, at nine years old, is not planning on giving up his dream of becoming a scientist when he grows up. In Bradenton, Crystal Knowles. It's a race against time. SNN, Suncoast News Network. Well, if you'd like to help, Rustic Paint Studio in Bradenton is hosting a fundraiser on December 6th from 7 to 9. Or you can sign up to be a bone marrow donor at bethematch.com.